And we're recording. That's it. Part four. Let's go. Uh, so, Rob, how do you feel about my new Discord nickname? Oh, no. What's what's your Discord nickname? Hang on. I didn't you check didn't that. You didn't see it yet? Is it in Chill Zone? Is that where it is? <laughs> yeah, specifically that one. Could you love... <laughs> Could you levitate the pants? I love it. I'll take six. I'm probably going to go clip that moment at some point. <laughs> it's a pretty good moment. Oh, hey. Fast travel. Our adventure continues. Cartesia okay. claims to have been trapped in a cat's body through a magic mirror by Safina. We release her to get more information on where to find Safina. And our journey now takes us to the Twilight Yard to find Professor Ima. Ima what? I don't remember zero last name. Nice. Uh, it, this game is just, it feels cozy to play this. I'm glad I'm playing this. Every time I boot this up, I'm just like, hell yes. I'm glad you're playing it. Mostly because <laughs> I'm here. <laughs> yeah, right. Hanging out, having a good time. I feel you. I'm just glad this doesn't have the ear grating music that uh that uh Dragon Quest Eleven has. <laughs> Shots fired. I just look, the battle theme gets really old really quick. Uh, you can leave it to Ivy Sarasho and Sabriel to not have that effect. <laughs> Thank God. <laughs> Block. No. Get bubbled. Oh, well. Hmm. Ba da 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 da. -da. Da -da -da -da. God, da -da -da -da. please no. <laughs> please no. That concludes my impression of the Dragon Quest XI battle. <laughs> the only fucking theme that game may as well have. That game has Pretty seven. That, that game has seven songs, and they're all MIDI and really low quality. <laughs> and most of them are from previous Dragon Quests. Some of them just straight up ripped from the uh, the mobile version of the first game. All right, uh, let's let's do this. There we go. You all got different boosts to your defense. <laughs> Yeah, it just depends who Rob's like the uh, who Rob likes the most. <laughs> Nella is a sweetie. I do like them. Hmm. Uh, so has the punch now. Yeah, I do. The one have the punch. he actually knows how to use. Oh, yes. You love to see it pay off. Let's go. Well, you love to see it pay off. I love <laughs> to ignore it and do things that I can actually time. <laughs> Fair enough.
You know, too bad that these enemies don't have guns. Why? Because then they could be shooting stars. Uh -huh. Oof. Alright. Let's get these guys out of here. Oh, I probably should have went for the other one since this one's poisoned. Oh well. It does so much damage. I love it when I'm not getting hit by it. Yeah, yeah, we're cool. past 10 now. <laughs> I'm getting, like, a good amount of money from these fights, and I like that. By the way, God, you asked if there was a level cap last time, and I said yes, but I never hit it. Did you want to know what that is? Uh, or are you good? Uh, 30 is my guess. You are correct. Yep, I figured. It's like Mario it's... RPG in that way. Yep, exactly. That's I, I, I was guessing it's probably... It's probably a reference to another game if it has one, and it's probably 30. The Ruby Ring. I'm more of an emerald guy myself, but. Uh, up to down one. Not bad. Are you an emerald guy because you're an agent of chaos? Sure. Oh, ah, now I get it. Okay, I was like, I was like, where's. <laughs> I was like, where's the where's the reference there? All right. Uh, I'm good. I got it. Uh, uh, the blue hairband is more brand appropriate, but I would like that power. Give me the power. That's right. Spoken like an agent of chaos. <laughs> oh, I need a heal merit. Oh, you love to see it. Sorry. <laughs> That's okay. I got you back. You nailed the force punch several times consecutively, and I made terrible pant jokes. It all evens out. Someday I'll also be ma be able to make terrible pants jokes, and then I'll be one of part of the fold. All right. Why does it feel like they get nine turns? Like, <laughs> stop t taking turns. Let me fight. Four of them, whereas there's only three of you. I guess. You're just delaying the inevitable because I'm going to punch you and it's really going to hurt. Oh, because she's in front of me. Got it. There you go. I bet the stars are very eager to take you on. They're like... Comment me, bro. Uh -huh. All right, well. I think they're better off climbing mountains and getting strawberries since, you know, they're celestial bodies. Uh -huh. I w when you said stars and mountains, I was like, I was like, what are you, what are you referencing? Like, and then, and then celestial. And I was like, haha, there it is. <laughs> if it I doesn't felt... make sense at first, it will uh, somehow turn into a joke. 
And it was a good one. I liked it. It was a good reference. Re good reference to yeah. good games. The one made by someone who worked directly with this game's developer. Exactly. The door is locked. It's locked. You need a key. Gosh, Rob. Get the key, Rob. I'm sorry. I'm working on it. Give me a minute. Get shit As I would do. tell you to get the key if that was where the game wanted you to go. <laughs> oh. <laughs> is it, Wait, am I playing this wrong? Is there somewhere I'm supposed to be right now? No, you're not. If you're looking around the yard is good, but you won't go through that door for a while. Garge. Okay. Do, 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 do. Okay. I think it's that building I saved in front of, right? That's probably where I need to be. The one where the cutscene took place, yeah. Yeah. Ah, damn it. Here, I'm just going to motivate myself. And, and do really And then the really punch will be poorly. extra powerful. I really suck it to him. All right. I can do this. That just does an unhealthy amount of damage. I just realized, uh, Nella, it shows their headband in battle, like the little purple headband they wear, but not Merit. Yep, that is correct. I'm not sure why exactly, but that's just how the sprites are done, I guess. It's kind of the same way that I never really thought about Cortese's curls. Oh, it's yeah. She's got those three big curls when you look at her portrait, but in battle it's, it doesn't really look like that because it's all a sprite. It's just a big fluffy afro. Yo, more power. Let's go. you love to see it. All right, you know what? I was exploring the yard. There's not much going on there, so great. Glad I wasted 12 minutes of our life. This is the astronomy tower, but I've never seen this strange lock bar in the way. There are six star-shaped slots in on it, but we don't have anything that will fit inside them. Hmm. Let's look around the courtyard a little more closely. I was just doing that. Maybe we can find something. <laughs> I got roasted. Maybe you should look more closely, Rob. I I can't look any closer than this. I can't really, zoom if in. I, if I look at your stream, you won't be uh, there with the TV directly adjacent to your face. I mean, I could do that. But I'm good, so so I'm not going to. Oh, is it the little firefly thingies? Mm, I only see five of those. Yeah, but there's a sixth one right there. Wait. Wait, where are you going? Come back. <laughs> uh, no, I don't believe it's the fireflies, but they do something. Oh. I. Hmm. Do you know how you did that? I checked a tree. Do you know why you checked that tree? No. Well, you might want to figure it out if you're going to find the rest. I don't know how that tree was any different than the thousands of other trees. <laughs> <laughs> but it was. I swear, there's a logic here. Mm. Do you like puzzles, Rob? Nope. That's why I'm not. That's why I'm not ever playing Professor Layton. Ah, <laughs> oh, what? You spurned me. Yeah. 
I don't know. I, I played Curious Village and I got stuck in like the easy ones and I was just like, yeah, I'm good. I, I just feel stupid playing this. I'm, I don't want to play it. Do I have to check the rocks? I do. Okay, Actually, look at what's happening. I, I... Go back to where you are and look at what's that. Never mind. It stopped happening because you picked it up. I'm going to fucking... This stupid ass fucking... Oh, is it in one of the benches? The tables? I, fucking the door? I don't know. <laughs> wood? What, twilight wood? I'm looking for wood. <laughs> this is amazing. I hate this. Do you what see was any different? No. Do you see, look at the screen right now. What? What? What am I looking at? Okay, as you keep looking. Pay the most attention possible to the fireflies. They won't help you on this screen anymore. You already found one. Whatever. But... Moving to the next screen then. Get the, the fireflies are your answer. They tell all. Uh, they're blinking right now. Did I find one on the screen? So oh. right now they're telling you there is nothing here. How do you? How do I know that? Hang on, there's a secret. There's nothing I need, there either. Hang on, I, need, I, got, I saw a treasure chest. I want it. That guy. Okay, but... I want to go get that. That one is clear where I need to go because there's a box. The mean greens. Ooh, speed goes up a little bit, defense down by one. Yeah, I'll take it. And it's on frame. To the bunny hop. Oh, speed super up, but movement down. Ah! No, give me that movement up. <laughs> yeah, there we go. And then... Okay, so... No stars on this screen. Okay. I don't know how I would know that. We'll see if you can figure it out as I tell you. No stars on that screen. None on this screen? Nope. I already found the one here in the tree. Yep. There is one on this screen. They look the same! Except the one. Except the one, right? Mmm. Whatever. This is dumb ass. I wonder if that, I think, could mean anything. Nope, means nothing to me. Uh, hi Amber, welcome. You get to see do me you get rage it now? it. Yeah, I, I get it now. Okay. Woo! Rob did puzzle. Yay! I, I do puzzle real good. All right, not on here. Not on here. One over there. Okay. I. Okay, not on here. I was like, where, where are y'all fucking going? Hidden under the bench. Yeah. How many did I give you? <laughs> uh. Well, I have one more. All right, it's over there. Are you enjoying your your what, McDonald's cup of ice? Something below the bench. Why'd the other one say under the bench and this one said below it? I'll never know. The secrets of the world. Let's go. We're done. Saving. HP. I never story. want to do it again. This game is the worst. <laughs> Zero out of ten. Glad I didn't pay for it. 
Well, technically, you pay to the service that uh, gives you access to it. <laughs> exactly. Dun, 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 dun. If this was Skyward Sword, it would have me do this nine more times in a different way. Uh, this build... <laughs> Camber, boo! <laughs> this building is so different from the others. This tower is where magic, history, mythology, and astronomy are taught. Mostly courses for first and second year students. Oh. Can we hurry it up a bit? Ima is probably in the observatory up top. I have a bad feeling about whatever plan Safina was hatching. It's alright, Purdy. I'm worried too. Saf gets into trouble a lot. But she's not gonna blow this place up. I I don't know if I believe that. Mm. What why are you here? What is this? I was staring oh, at that uh, throughout the entire cutscene. Well, okay, but there's also one on the left side, so that's like the uh, Oh decoration. I think it's meant to be like the base of the tower. Gotcha. In a time long before our own, there only existed the vastness of space. Uh, except for the great whale, Walla, who wandered the great emptiness for millennia. Walla found no other soul in her journey, no matter how far and wide she, she searched. But she did find magic. It had existed long before her, and would exist long after. Okay, great. Sure. Oh, it, it made a whale shape. Okay, now I get it. Breathing in as much magic as she could, blowing it out her blowhole, don't say that, with all her might. <laughs> out came all the stardust of the galaxy, glowing bright and beautiful. Overcome with joy, Walla flipped and turned, and her tail set the stop laughing, the stardust in all directions. It gathered across the galaxy and formed all the planets, stars, suns, and moons. Stop laughing. To this day, Walla still swims across the vast galaxy. She's no longer alone. Great. Fortunately, he didn't need to know that it was a whale. He just have to make the stars glow. Yeah. Oh. Why are you attacking? Oh, did you think I was an ordinary lamp? I mean, yes. And these lamps really take after Crash Bandicoot. <laughs> yeah, they're spinning a lot, aren't they? Yo, fighty time. Let's go. Oh, I screwed that up. Oh. I just love that this is free. <laughs> yeah, oh. usually a glass cannon is very fragile, but in Purdy's case, it's a whole new meaning. Yeah. Because her magic is glass and it hurts, but it also protects so you're not the fragile one. <laughs> Did you see how much damage that fucking did to me, by the way? Even with the defense buff of three, it did five. Nah, that's not so bad at this stage. I mean, even still, I got a huge defense buff. Oh, geez, they're worth a lot, though, so I'm going to fight these a lot if I can. Yeah, 
You made an oopsie. Yo, you love to see it. <clears throat> Honey Crisp. Rook is inching closer to the level that he will technically not have earned. <laughs> Hmm. I mean... Let's just get these fights out. Get down here, I want to fight you. Jesus. I'd say that they do a light amount of damage, but that would be wrong. At least in one sense. <laughs> there we go. Sweet. I wonder what makes that potion so soothing. <laughs> Good point. Is it chamomile, maybe? Chamomile? No, I don't think it is. Hmm. I mean, I think if Nella... Gave some chamomile to the party member in front of them. Then we would have Perticia. Hey, there you go. Love to see it. There we go. I'll poison you. It'll do damage over time. <laughs> like, dead. <laughs> what was that weak attack? Merely poison? Oh! <laughs> oh, I see, I see. Okay. So this one goes here. And this one goes here. There is a button next to the stairs that resets them. So. Oh, that just in case, yeah. Because you can miss. <laughs> but I didn't want you to press it after you already put them in the right spot. <laughs> yeah, I didn't even notice the button anyway, so it works out. Where's the button? See, the stairs that you came from at the top, it's on the oh, left. Oh, yeah, there it is. I see it. Okay. Oh, well, okay. Oh my god, it's a moon! It's a very creepy moon. TBH. Ha ha, funny joke. Oh. Smooch! <laughs> no smooches. I think you'll make out alright. <laughs> You need the heal. There you go. Stop smooching. No smooches. <laughs> I'm punching you instead. Do 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 do. Mm, 
Is there no way I can position us to heal them too? No, that's the same with the first healing spell. That's it's kind of a thing. Nella cannot heal themselves. That's a bummer. Minus items. Right. Or at least not with your current repertoire. There might be one towards the end. Might. I, I think there is, but since I'm not 100% sure, I'm saying might. Okay, gotcha. Mm, okay. Oh. Poison party. Yeah, right. <laughs> Screw you. That'll show up. <laughs> Patui. I didn't know Dark Pit from Uprising was in this game. Yeah, right. Amber says uh, they're too tired to pun. Womp, womp, womp. Oh, wait, hang on. I can probably. Yeah, if I position this, boom, boom. There we go. You fools, you stood at a cross section. There we go. You love to see it. That's how you meteor end. Yo, it's just nothing but fucking strength buffs, and I'm like, really cool with that? Let's go. Yeah, I'm usually the kind speed, of... speed, occasionally HP. That's all you'll ever see out of a level. Mm -hmm. that, that's good, because my playstyle normally includes just going ham on the attack power. St standing in a three-way intersection? Oof. Big oof. Great. I'm getting pumped up, but ooh, I hit my head with my fist while I was pumping myself up. I'm <laughs> not as pumped up anymore. Whoops. <laughs> oh, whoops, I died. Yo, clean. Let's go. I'm great, I think. Eh, I don't know. <laughs> don't we all have those moments? It's every day. You hate to feel it. You may wish to consult the doctor if your lack of motivation is due to punching yourself in the face trying to motivate yourself. But also, why did you punch yourself in the face trying to motivate yourself? <laughs> well, you can't motivate yourself without going fist bump, fist bump, fist bump. It's a science. It, it, that's just how it works. Uh... I'm going to pick you up and bring you right over there and then for you get punched <laughs> something something paper mario reference to the little star enemy <laughs> Yeah, I mean, take your pick. Twink, the star spirits, uh, the crystal stars, uh, well, Super Paper Mario did hearts instead. And then the series went <laughs> the wrong direction. So. <laughs> Can't disagree with that. <laughs> I, I didn't play... 
uh, origami, but you know people like it, so I'll I'll let them have it. But I like that one, but it's not it's not what I used to want out of Paper Mario. <laughs> yeah, it's not really what I'm looking for. I was I was like I played through Sticker Star, despised that game. That is legitimately a bad game. And then I played Color Splash, and I was like, well, it wasn't as bad, but I still don't like it. And then, yep. <laughs> and then Origami King was like, well, it still has the same problems as Color Splash, but gosh dang it, it's so pretty. Look how pretty it is. And I'm like, yeah, I'm good. I'm it good. had the best soundtrack of that year. <laughs> That's good. I'm, I'm glad the soundtrack bops. I know a lot of people are hype on it. <laughs> Amber, what do you mean? Sticker Star is truly the greatest of our time. It's the greatest something, all right. I just... I really want to know if they released that game and they were like, this is cool. Like, this is what we want to make. The sad thing is I think yes. <laughs> just, I'm so tired. I just... I. What upsets me is that I want a Mario RPG series that isn't reliant on Ubisoft making them, please. <laughs> like, I don't... Like, don't get me wrong. Mario Plus Rabbids is unironically my favorite Mario game, period. But I don't want it attached to Ubisoft. I want... I want Nintendo to make one. I want Intelligent Systems to make one. I want... I don't know... Fucking Atlas to make one. I don't give a shit. Give me one. <laughs> Revive Alpha Dream from the grave and get them to do it. Sadly, I don't think that'll happen. <laughs> oh, I just had a thought. That's scary. What if Next Level just decided to do it? Oh. <gasps> Yo, if Next Level Games did it, I'd be 100% on board with that. Be a 1,000% on board. Yeah, we made Luigi's Mansion. We're saving up our ideas for four. So how about we just help you with an RPG? Yo, nothing but, nothing but bumps. Let's go. Oh, well, except you. <laughs> you already had that. You don't get another one. You can't yeah. give her a second cold shoulder. People with <laughs> two shoulders, I'll have you know. <laughs> Every human comes pre-equipped with two of them, or at least a majority. Eh. 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 Okay, there we go. Oh, what's this? Entire party by five for three to Oh my god, that is the next boss fight for sure. I am <laughs> I am gonna use that and just ruin its day. It showed up, it was like, alright shit, I'm sorry. <laughs> Jeez, <laughs> leave, leave me alone. I didn't mean to. And then it'll be like, okay, thanks, bye. <laughs> There we go. You love to heal it. All right. Oh. Darkness. Hello, darkness. What are these star cookies? What are, what are these? Speed by eight? Shit. It's just my turn for the next eight turns. Huh, you picked a really bad spot. Okay. <laughs> hey, Lamp, how do you feel about being punched by a moon? <laughs> you hate to see it. All right. Ah! Why? Why are you closed? Mm. He is not having a good day. 
Eh, whatever. They're fine. I'm just glad they didn't go for Nella. That kiss was not consensual. You know what? Fuck this moon. This moon sucks ass. I'm getting... Punching it, it for three! Your lip. Yikes. No, I'm good. Uh... Hmm. Just like the end of uh, Donkey Kong Country Returns? I'm not sure I get that. I never beat that game. I beat or... that game, so I get it. Actually, I don't even think I played that one. I only played uh, Tropical Freeze. Man, these people do not like Merit. I found Returns was much better on the 3DS. Oh, is the 3DS version just, like, the better of the two? Well, uh, if you can work with the Wii motion controls, then be my guest. But I liked the buttons. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. I usually prefer just things being on buttons anyway. Of course, if they wanted to put that on Switch to satiate the Donkey Kong gap for a bit... And have both options. Wouldn't then. be against it. <laughs> Could be. Plus, better upscaling. Because, you know, 3DS is a tiny little handheld. It wasn't the greatest resolution. Neither mm. was the Wii, for that matter. Tropical Freeze got that upgrade. So, like, why not? <sighs> and someone pointed out that with the original trilogy on NSO, that Returns is the only Donkey Kong Country that's not on the Switch. Oh, well, 64, isn't it? But that's not country, that's... Oh, country, yeah. <laughs> it's basically... It's a little different. It's basically it's the exact 3D. same. No, it's exactly the same. I don't see the difference. <laughs> They're the same game. Let's be real. DKC1, in 3D, same game. No difference whatsoever. Name one difference between the two. <laughs> Name one difference between the two. I'll wait. Lanky Kong? Don't. 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 <laughs> On one world lived the Maja, <laughs> the 12 great mammoths whose trunks could reach the sky. They were the first of all his children to invent uh, and created language so they may speak. Cool. This isn't really like a puzzle because it's just pushing the shapes until they glow. But like, it's, you know, the little stories are cute. It is a task and you get lower. There we go. See, they're trying to be a little tricky now, because it's not the very edge. There we go. So yeah, give us Donkey Kong Country Returns Returns with the full 60 FPS 1080 button controls. Leave the motion in if you want it as an option, but make it optional. <laughs> yeah. That's the thing. As long as it's optional, I don't mind when games have motion controls, but it's like it's like when you have shit like Mario Odyssey that forces you to use them. I'm just like, God, I just... I would enjoy this game a lot more if I never had to shake my controller. And, I, and don't get me wrong, it doesn't ruin that game. Like, I, I... There are other parts of that game I don't enjoy, but overall, I enjoy that game, right? But, like... 
like Skyward Sword when they added in the button controls. I was like, yeah, you added the button controls. And they're like, and we didn't do anything else. And I'm like, okay, great. <laughs> great. Love it. Hmm. What's going on here? Oh, it's, uh, yeah, a little pushy boys from the top there. That's great, foam. Don't buzz. Thank you. I think, like, right here. Then I want to say, like, right there. And I want to say, like, right here. Hey, who's a fucking pro? This guy. Let's go. Shoutouts to uh, FF6 and 9 being my favorite versions of that song. I need to go back and finish FF6 at some point. FF6 is a good time. I'm not as hype as everyone else, but it's like... I didn't have a bad time playing it, so... And the fucking soundtrack is just... Oh, so good. I was enjoying it, and then I stopped playing it for I don't know why. <laughs> and we all get that sometimes, like, just distractions and whatnot. <laughs> as we play FF1... That's your game, Amber. Actually play my FF1 ROM <laughs> Can I cop that? Can there be an ASROM hack? Uh, yo, make every character, like, different. All the classes are, like, your favorite games in some way. And no line can get uttered without a pun. Uh, God, if every line was a pun, that'd be a lot. <laughs> uh, with levitate, does it? Is there a way to know how far it'll carry the enemy, or is that all like random? If it's a regular enemy, like the lamp, then it's probably going to go all the way across the field. But if gotcha. it's a heavier enemy, then maybe three spaces. Gotcha. But, uh, you know, but even... The even though they get carried different spaces because of the weight, that also increases the amount of time it takes to lift them. So yeah. the timing, from a, from a pure time standpoint, should be the same regardless. Way to punch the lights out. <laughs> I didn't even have to ask you to do it that time. Oh boy. Um... Crater, baby. That is a cute enemy. I like the idea of like the moon splits up into a bunch of little baby moons. Yeah, but the original moon was just after all your kisses. Yeah. So it went from a giant creep to being split into three childlike beings. Yo! Good timing. Level 12 Marines, Meteorite, and... Ooh, toxic, toxic Cloud. cloud. 
Let's fucking go. I like the sound of that. Oh my god, money for days! Let's go! That's Poggies. Sleep tight. Uh. Mm, it nah. defensive. Very defensive. Not very fast, though. Yeah, very, very slow. I have a slow time getting to sleep most nights. Jeez. I can Jeez. never just conk out. Because uh, she needs the speed right now, but she also needs the defense. Look at her defense. It's so bad. Nah, defense is never really merits strength. And then there's this one. It's like, I want you to move a lot. But like, well, that's God why you damn. gotta ask, is that one space totally worth it to you? Yeah, because it's nice. And when I take it off, I'm gonna feel naked. <laughs> like I'm gonna eat it. <laughs> I don't know. I just I felt like there was a secret here, and there wasn't. Now I'm sad. A flower of some kind. I saw it. it. It was the frenzy flower, which you read about that one earlier, and we're like, next boss, man. Oh, hell yeah, let's go. And now I got two of them. And and for clarity, again, uh, buffs like that do not stack, correct? So if I were to use right. two of them, it wouldn't be like plus 10 offense to my characters. Yeah, I think all you can do with buffs is renew them. Gotcha. That makes sense. That's how Persona does it. Ooh. Oh, your defense goes way down, but... Damn, your speed and power go up. Mmm... Those are both nice. Uh, I don't know. You clad, of course you should pick the parry ring. Uh, I, I mean, I mean, I know. That was a reference. Oh, I don't think I understood it then. Sorry. You don't know a character that says Claude a lot? No. Do you know I? what Perry is short for? Per 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 persuasive? I don't know. I don't... <laughs> I, so I, the gem in that ring is a paradox. Oh, I never watched that show. You plan? Why didn't you watch it? Because uh, I didn't have cable at the time and I don't really have an interest in watching it. <laughs> oh, yo, buffs. Let's go. Okay. Been through the power. Uh, our world was full of mountains, valleys, canyons, and seas. Beautiful at last. Across it flew Rava, the great raven. She flew until she knew every inch of the world. Uh, oh. 404 underscore preview. Thank you for following. Uh, let's see. Aye. You'll love to see it. <clears throat> ah. I, I was I wondering when you were going to try the right edge. 
And then I'm assuming it's a mirrored. They just talked about a great raven. Yeah. So it's like kind of mirrored, but not really. Because it's like a bird. That that does not look like a raven. I'm gonna be real with you. That 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 looks that looks like a funnel. That is not. Well, you've a never done a drawing where the birds were just two lines. I mean, yeah, but they're me. yeah, but they're curved. It's like two ends. It's like an M, but with the the left and right side raised up. Uh, while Walla and Magi are gone to us, Ravis children will watch over us even to this day. That's cool. Poggers. Yo, this they heard cabinet? about the raven because that's the bird that comes tell the witches that they're ready for Ickenfell. <laughs> no refunds. So if you oh. didn't buy those weapons before, they are here now. Yeah. She could really use this. For one less power, I think I can justify didn't, this. But you have one. Is it on someone? I think so. Yeah. It's on them. It's on Nella. Alright, I don't want to read that every time. Thank you. But it's Mistress Mahogany's cabinet, and you, it's in the prototype phase. Put the money in, and there's no refunds. <laughs> Why do you have to tell me this every time? <laughs> because it's Mistress Mahogany's cabinet, which is in the prototype phase. My God, you're the worst. <laughs> you're the fucking worst. <laughs> Uh, you know, the light warriors aren't gendered in FF1. They can all be NBs. Oh, that's true. Well, no, because warrior of light, uh, is male. But other than that, I think it's NBs, right? They, or they can be NBs, right? So. Yo, buff. Let's go. Oh wait, there's a treasure chest. No, move. <laughs> Flare bay. Walk through books. Ridiculous. <laughs> Not in this household. Mm, no. Mm, no. No. Super no. Okay. Uh, yeah, I should probably, should probably do that. Oh no, the top of the tower. I am scared. Oh no. What in the world happened here? This place is a total disaster. I don't, I don't like oh. this at all. I've got a bad feeling. I see a cat there. Oh my god, that... Who's this derpy little friend? Hello there. Welcome to the observatory. Uh-oh. Did I scare you? Sorry about that. Call me Twinkle Dwarf. Or just Twinkle for short. Why are you, like, derpy? Twinkle, <laughs> oh, twinkle, it is huge. A little huge? <laughs> we were just startled a bit, that's all. I can't bl blame you. Stick him in a centrifuge. <laughs> I'm so r ridiculously cute after all. Yo, Amber, just like you. Let's go. That's what surprised us. <laughs> <laughs> No. <laughs> hey, Twinkle, was there anyone here in the observatory? Hmm, an older student? Yeah. Wait, how did you know an older student? Well, with a cute yellow dress and a paintbrush wand? 
This is like weirdly specific. That's the one. <laughs> Why are you so sp never heard of them? Nope. Yeah, exactly. Never, <laughs> <laughs> never seen them. <laughs> <laughs> what, then why'd you describe them in such intricate detail? <laughs> Our friend here is telling us something. <laughs> Are we telling some secrets? I, I have a secret too. If you come over here, I'll tell you. No, oh, I'm going to touch you and get into a fight. Oh. Oh no. Well. Hang on, just gonna, just gonna pet this cat real quick. Hang on, gonna. There we go, nice and clean. All right. Uh, we're good on. Yeah, yeah, we're good. Okay. Um. All right, Twinkle. I think you know very well where Ima is. You, you guessed my secret. Want to know another secret? The secret is that Z was delicious. Oh my god, he walks. That's kind of creepy. Right, uh, that, that's the part that should uh, terrify you, not the part where he eats someone. <laughs> nah, that's kind of normal for JRPGs. I'm used to that. I don't like those legs, Amber says. <laughs> well, he, I mean, Twinkle Dwarf does not skip leg day, clearly, and how can you argue with bulging thighs? <laughs> Done by this same character designer as uh, Knuckles from Sonic Boom. Summon meteorites from the sky effective against flying enemies. Well, that's not this one, so. Yeah, then I can hit up to three adjacent. Wait, so I can. If they're behind me. Yes. This just, last time it was blocking me because of that. I, all right, whatever video game you fucking <laughs> you do your best. I'm proud of you. Do, 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 do. <laughs> all right. <sighs> Fuck. If I motivate myself, maybe I can have legs as big as Twinkle Dwarf. Oh no, what am I <laughs> saying? I can't put a standard on myself like that. That's an oopsie. All right, there. Everyone gets plus five. Fuck it. <laughs> Everyone's buff as hell. Let's go. Oh, God. Don't do that. <laughs> Scary. At least I can get the nice timing to uh, only deal one damage on that. Oh, thanks, Ted Purdy. Uh, engulf an area in a poisonous cloud. Okay. So in that case, is it okay? Well, does the does the cloud linger, or is that just the area of effect? Uh, for... I believe it's the latter, and I don't know if it causes poison status the way that poison does. Well, it doesn't when I oops. Well, if it did, it wouldn't have that time. <laughs> Back the fuck up. <laughs> I'll show you stars. Guess where I keep my minis. I don't want to hear about your minis. Star friends. Look at how chill they are. Inside my me. That's where I could keep them. 
Oh, I keep my children inside my tummy. <laughs> Just like a woman's pregnancy. <laughs> Except I regret to take them. <laughs> Why are you the most cursed sounding creature on this planet? <laughs> you don't like my impression of you doing that voice? <laughs> <laughs> this is the most terrifying boss in any game. <laughs> Oh, hey, it did cause poison on both of them. <laughs> yeah. That's good, at least. Why do you get so many turns? It's so unfair. <laughs> He's the boss. Enbies <laughs> aren't for eating, unless they want it. Uh, I mean, do they want it? Okay, hang on. Yeah. Oh, wait. Yeah. Oh my god, y'all fucking killers! Well, you missed the timing. <laughs> uh... Oh, wait, we need... Oh, I think it's because our defense run out. There we go. There we go. Feel better! Noich. So wait, does the punch deal more damage than the regular? I wonder. That'll just take some testing. Oh, it just, it does the same amount of damage. Well, I guess the punch's only real benefit is that it makes them fly backwards. And that potentially isn't... into other enemies, yeah. Yeah, and then the hit the other enemies thing, if I can get that to pop off, you know? Great. Um, yeah, and then it'll be... That little dude has had it too good. Yeah, right. He's out of here. Okay, and then... Now that we're out of buffs... Let's do it! Oh, y'all are about to fucking die. Okay. You fools. You stood in the perfect position. Clean. Look how clean that was. Let's go. Yeah, spew out more of your ugly ass babies. Spew your shitty babies all you want. Yeah, let's go. Triangle Dwarf is a toxic friend. If he thinks that eating people is okay. Uh, yo, uh, nah, I'm not, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna take this turn to experiment. I'm good. Yo, perfect. Let's go. You'll love to see it. You'll love to see it, baby. 
Let's go. Hew, 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 hew. Oh, hashtag crazy mode. Let's go. Time to pop up play. I'm Doug Dimidome, owner of the Dimsdale Dimidome. I'm also Spinda, the Pokemon oh that people don't tend to remember. <laughs> I'm I'm Spinda, the character that exists. I swear. <laughs> okay. Uh, there's one, There's an item that's like distant party members, right? Yeah. It's like a. I believe it's a pink thing. Oh, I forgot I had these. Huh. Those are pretty good. Bum, 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 bum. All right. There we go. Nice heels, baby. Let's go. Yeah, that dude's very aggro now, so I won't blame you for the defense. Yeah. That's horribly distracting, and I hate that. Oh, you mean you don't like them throwing in little ones that don't actually hit you? Surprisingly, no. Aha, uh -huh, spiraling. I get it. Oh, shit. Oh, boy. Red dwarfs. It's like a dork, but with an extra W. The W stands for... For what? Worse. Let me know. Worse than a dark. <laughs> it stands for Wumbo. No, no, those guys are little. He has it set to M for many, but they're. <laughs> I mean, like the big guy's a Wumbo. You think anyone's ever done an independent study major in Wombology? <laughs> no, Ezra, I don't. <laughs> yeah, I, I someone's found a way to game the system to do that. No, I, I really, I really don't. I don't. <laughs> you, you might be shocked to realize that I so don't. What if someone did? <laughs> <laughs> I, I wouldn't know, Ezra, I really wouldn't. <laughs> What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> oh my god, they explode! Oof. That was a lot. Okay. <laughs> You're really like proud of yourself for that one too. That's the best part. Uh, I I'm actually trying to look this up, and it's <laughs> weird the re the results you get for searching one biology major are very interesting. <laughs> they don't sound very uh, fruitful, though. No, I might be a, there. There might be a cult. Oh, uh, might be. I don't like might be. Mm. 
someone <laughs> someone made a Weebly website for the University of Wombology. I hate that. <laughs> That's <laughs> awful. Oh, I could take the final exam. <laughs> God. They're, they also offer a course in micro wombology. Micro wombology? <laughs> what does that even mean? Do you want me to read the definition? <laughs> If you could. Because I'm going to hate it. <clears throat> Microwombology is the study of large atoms and things using the periodic table. Mm -hmm. The biggest atom in the world of wombology is cesium. Cesium has an atomic number of 55 and an atomic mass of about 133. Huh. It was discovered by Fustov Kirchhoff in 1860. I'm, I mean, that's cool. I can't believe it's a real thing. <laughs> the only real thing there is cesium. <laughs> oh, the rest of that is made up? I mean, the study of large atoms. I I'm sure that's a thing, but I don't think it's called microwombology. <laughs> <laughs> I think it is. <laughs> oh, wait. I just found a more tab on the website. Oh, no. What's on the Bio more tab? Biowombology, theoretical wombology, world wombo and creatures... Wombological gender studies. Wombological engineering. <laughs> Wombological engineering? <laughs> That's not a thing. That's not real. <laughs> I reject that reality. I want to read on Wombological gender studies. That's... That's not... That's... I'm sure that's fucked up. <laughs> I'm sure I'm going to hate whatever the fuck that is. There are two Wumbo genders. Wumbo and Wumbo. <laughs> <laughs> That's not real. There's no are you way. Ready for, are you ready for the final exam? Because that was the course. That was the entire course? Wombologically, how many genders are there? About two, I reckon. Potato or 420. <laughs> God. And then the second question, what are those previously mentioned genders? Oof. I'm not going to read the options on this one. <laughs> yeah, uh, probably... Probably best not to. Um, Where's the boss going? Hey, you know, I'm getting it. Do you think the boss identifies as Wumbo or Wumbo? <laughs> I think this boss sucks.
Oof. And. Hey. Let's go. I like how every achievement is a rare achievement now because of what I assume a lot of players tend not to play this far into the game. Or at least just not a lot of people have done it. Ooh, Jeremy. Uh, there's your movement up spell. Ah, shit. Now I need him in the party. A you can have him back whenever you want. And it's kind of funny how he's only getting 90% of the experience, but <laughs> he's above uh, pet... A Petri, Petri, blue one. He's above the blue one. Blue one. <laughs> Don't send me back. I give you. I'll give you the paint back. The painting, which Purdy. Yeah, there we go. Thank you. Blake. The amber knows. Hang on, I gotta save. <laughs> I know you were just being digested, but give me a moment. <laughs> hey. They're not being digested now. Destroy sin trips. Oh my god, that's so good. I'm paying attention while working on my ROM hack. Hell yeah, let's go. Do you have work today or do you have the day off, Amber? Uh, sorry, someone sent me a message. Had to make sure we're good. Okay. One of these days, someone should send you a massage instead. <laughs> I would appreciate it. <sighs> okay, so I enjoy Nella. They're they're like really useful because I like the poison, but like and the healing. <laughs> oh, and the healing. God, fuck! Now I want all of them. <laughs> you made it worse because I want this. I want this. I want this and this. Playing Mario Bros. 3 with Ash in a couple hours. Oh, nice. Let's go. Ooh, ooh. I'm supposed I'm supposed to play uh, Doritos Crash Course with Steve, but he hasn't gotten back to me about scheduling that yet. He sent me a message the other day. He's like, hey, my man, I apparently we're supposed to play games. And I'm like, yeah, you have an Xbox? And then he just never replied. <laughs> I'm a... Euro. Ugh, where am I? We're in the astron- <clears throat> Oh, that's right. Uh... Did you all see what happened? We had front row seats. No, you don't understand. That star creature over there. Oh. I painted it into this world. Oh, is that why it's all derpy? Uh, wait, you mean you summoned it? No. I didn't use a summoning circle or anything. I just painted it here with my magic. Without a summoning circle? That shouldn't be possible. I know. That's the best part. Wait, so normally you can't do that? No, not like this. I'm a painting whip, so I can produce colors, shapes, images. But conjuring a living spirit usually takes months of preparation. It's just like Mara and Gilda. Gilda suddenly has superpowers. She can summon lightning. And Merit had no magic at all until recently. None at all. I'm an ordinary. I came to Ickenfeld to find my sister, Safina. But as soon as I got here, I suddenly had magic powers. Safina. Your, Your sister? sister. I'm, I'm telling you, my JRPG brain is saying there's some fucked up shit where we're actually Safina or like an altar or something like that. Like there's some, some like crazy shit going on and I, I want to know if That's I'm right. That's actually why we're here. 
we know you were meeting with Safina in secret. All these strange happenings. She's behind it all, isn't she? Uh, come on, Purdy. Safina wouldn't. Maybe. The. <laughs> really? So she's missing now. This can't be good. We're not the only ones with changing magic. Safina created a new spell. Something very powerful. A small heart-shaped prism. You mean this? That's it. She said it shows things for what they truly are. With it, she was able to see things, to find things. Things that were hidden under our noses in plain sight. That always have been. Like the old books in the study hall. Exactly. Things that seem no different when I look through it. It doesn't work on its own. There's some way to unlock it. Safina never told me how to do it. Of course it's locked. Ugh. So frustrating. How are we supposed to track her down? I just know she's up to something. Safina kept bringing me strange, ancient books she was finding. We weren't working to translate them. The runes were all unfamiliar. She found something out. Something about the headmistress? Yes. I'm not completely sure, but I think I might know what she was on to. I think it has something to do with the Summer Stone. More of a spring guy. Maybe a fall. The summer I like stone. winter. Winter's nice, but I have to deal with snow, and I fucking hate the snow. So, uh, it just it sucks having a long driveway. It's just not fun. <laughs> uh, that thing again. I've heard it mentioned a few times. It's a popular object around here. It's wonderful. When you touch it, you feel so nice, so comfortable. Like when you snuggle up under a warm blanket. <laughs> they really enjoyed that. When I touch it, I get a strong sense of nostalgia. Oh shit, it's an ape escape orb? We have to find it! <laughs> it makes me think of home. Of my parents' old dusty bookshelves. It really is wonderful. Anyway, when Safina wouldn't tell me what she was up to, I got suspicious. Got a little sus. I caught up with a few students from Spirits and asked her about it. Apparently, she had been making many visits to the Summer Stone this year. We know how protective the headmistress is of the Summer Stone. I think Safina discovered something about it. Something she wasn't supposed to know. Using the heart-shaped prism. Exactly. We need to get to the Summer Stone, then. But we don't know how to unlock the prism's power. Well, we're going to have to solve it. We need to stop all this dangerous magic from spawning everywhere. But also to find out the truth of this all. I feel like there's a lot more to this story we're missing. So, what do we do? It's late. Let's rest here for now. There's no beds. We'll regroup in the morning and decide what to do. I don't want to sleep on a desk. Oh. Purdy is making this really hard. Purdy gets the cat. <laughs> she doesn't like us very much. I don't even think it's that. She was Saf's biggest rival. The two never got along. 
We were Saf's best friends. She'll never trust us. I think there's more to it. I feel bad for her. I know what it's like to be left out. It can't feel good to have everyone take sides against you. Artesia, are you alright? Why were you helping Safina? Artesia, you know I can't pick sides. But you know very well what she's capable of. I do. <laughs> the others, they hate me, you know. Have you given them any reason not to? Wouldn't make a difference. I, I feel like it would, but okay. Everyone isn't always who they appear on the surface, Patricia. You of all people should know that. How is the spell holding up? It's fine. Come on, let me have a look. Good morning. Is everyone ready to go to the Spirit Oval? Spirit Oval? That's where spirits, conjuring, and summoning are taught. <clears throat> it's also where it's the, also summer, where the summer Stone is located. Shit, sorry. Just got it. I got too into it. <laughs> How do we get there? Remember the southern dorms where we found Rook? From the main courtyard, there's a big green building east of there. That's the Great Hall, which leads to the Spirit Oval. But before we go, let me do something about this mess. Yo, let's go. Now you're going to have an even harder time picking party members. Yo. What do you got? Uh, strike a ranged enemy with a conjured spear. Dope. Storm of Arrows. Love to see it. A single target, multi-hit. Oh, fucking regen? Let's go. Okay. Yes. Uh, you now have another way to heal. Uh, powerful trap, invisible to enemy eyes. You love to and see And an alternate it. form of trap magic. Conjure a puppet to distract foes. Okay, that's not bad, not bad. And power-wise, uh, zero, zero on the same level. So... Yeah, that spear can get pretty high in the damage output. Uh, okay. Wait, you're selling stuff? What are you selling? How can I help you? Hello, uh... Yeah, he's selling stuff. Uh, if it's anything like Pratisia, then you won't be able to switch zero out for a bit. Hmm. That's fine. I'm assuming I get one more party member based on the save slot. You and your assumptions. Look, there's spot for one more person. That's all I'm saying. And all I'm saying is nothing. <laughs> oh wait, I can, I can be careful. If you just want to leave, you can talk to the star. Yeah, yeah. I, I was like, oh wait a minute. <laughs> Happy to oblige. Don't eat me. Oh. I, I I asked for the wrong thing. <laughs> Did you want to get down or not? You can't get down without being eaten. Ridiculous. Yeah, absolute nonsense. Why is it the select button, the, the map? It's like, it'd be so much easier. Or the X button? Like, that doesn't do anything right now? Keeping the buttons minimum, I guess. I guess.
This is so cozy. If you're walking diagonally, you can't move to other screens. That's weird. <laughs> I love when Z, Z do that. Z, is it? Okay, so... Z it would be Z does that, right? Yeah. Okay, that makes sense. The Great Hall of Ikenfeld. A uh, place of fine feasts and melodious music. Visitors Those are, are two things I love. <laughs> Hell yeah. I'm mostly a feast kind of guy. So, like, <laughs> I'm plus two for feast, but, you know, you can enjoy the music. The music's a bonus. Let's go. <laughs> Why? You've just been sitting in here. How are you not dead? <laughs> we... The, uh, we you've well, been the locked in? really does have this place locked down, I'll have you know. I've been helping other students get back to their rooms. That's not true. <laughs> I guess it was a bad year to stay here for the summer. How are you not dead? I guess I just get lonely at home during the break. It's much more fun to make friends with the students who stay here. But you know who I'd like to meet the most? Sally of Snow. We used to always look forward to her performances, but she seemed lonely. I thought maybe she needed a friend. Her songs were so kind-hearted. Anyway, sorry I got carried away. <laughs> I don't know what y'all are up to, but it looks serious. Good luck. Chop chop up top. Oh. It's my thing, you know, you gotta raise your hand and never mind. Take care of y'all. I'll make sure to stay and I'll make sure any stray kids don't get hurt. Sorry, it's just weird to hear stray kids. Yeah. Rare job. I mean I know what he means and it's it's not terrible word choice, but you know. It, it is re weird to read it out. You see the word stray and you're thinking, oh, cat, and then it wasn't a cat. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> today we have a returning performer. Some of you will remember her from last year. Oh, that hair looks familiar. Uh, she wears she she wears music weaves music <laughs> and magic together into a beautiful tapestry. I wish Please I could wear back. music. <laughs> Sally Snow. Psst. Hey, new guy. Excuse you. I'm not. Oh shit. I, I didn't mention it because this is the point you're supposed to find out. Oh, I fucked up. No, been... no, he does use he, him pronouns. Oh, okay, okay. He's about to say that, in fact, I think. Uh, okay. Good for, good for him. This is what I said. The game has moments like this. I'm in, I'm Safina in fuck... assumed male. Yeah, yeah. The other cast says, love her. Apparently her performances last year had half the audience crying. From what I heard, her voice is an echo of the song of creation itself. Though I think that's a bit dramatic. <laughs> Amber's like envy. She's also super cute. Yeah, so Amber, uh, most of the party is envy now. Three Yo, fifths of it. Let's go. You love to see it. I'm going to introduce myself after. Break a leg. Look at that cinnamon roll on top of that sprite. So yeah, to recap, Nella uses they them pronouns. Brooke, non-binary, but uses he him pronouns. And then Ima, who uses Neo pronouns Z and Zir. Mm. Welcome back, students. For this year's opening show, we have a singer from the far south. What? No Salia this year? Uh n n Oh, the, their last Whatever name. Whatever her last name is. Yeah, right. Miss Snow has retired. She won't be returning. Aw. That's a shame. 
Now, please welcome to the stage. Hmm. Okay. So, was there any deeper meaning to this or no? Or was that just pretty much like that was... That flashback gets elaborated on a lot later. Okay. So, in that case, I have a theory for that. And my theory... Hello, cat. I have nothing to put in your mouth. Don't take that out of context. Uh, <laughs> my theory okay. is uh, that uh, Safina, like, went and talked to a Cinnamon Singer lady... And, uh, I, I think it's not a coincidence that the singer's hair is awfully similar to Purdy's. Just, just kind of made sense, you know, just kind of, I don't know, you know, it's a little, little weird. I'm trying to talk to the ghost. Can't talk to the ghost. <laughs> don't confirm shit in this house. Do you want me to confirm why you can't talk to the ghost? Uh, yeah, you can do that at least. This is an art exhibit. Someone made a replica. Gotcha. Hell yeah, let's go. You solved the mystery. It wasn't was a very difficult one. Literally written one. on the top of the pillar. <laughs> yeah, it wasn't a very difficult mystery, but I'm glad it was solved. Cool. Ooh. Crystal. Damn it. I will look at all this art, damn it. What's going on over here? I've been here. Yo? Hold up. It's one of those memory shards. The fact they pointed this one out makes me think it's important. So, they show you memories from around the school. Yes, we found several of them. Including one 30 seconds ago. Yeah, you saw me touch it 30 seconds ago. Uh, that's how we knew you'd be meeting with Safina. Incredible. Incredible. I wonder where they're coming from. Oh, um... I wonder if we'll learn anything useful. Hmm... There we go, perfect. Are you sure nobody will notice? It looks identical to the original pic. Oh! <laughs> oh, shit! Your application turned out perfect! Oh my god, what? I'm just glad I finally got to put my magic ink to the test. But it's good that we managed to stop it. Can't believe that painting had been possessing students for years. What the fuck? Right? It sure did a number on you. Uh, about that. When I was possessed, I, uh... Oh! What? Thanks for not... I knew you were possessed. This two nose deep in his books to... Whoa, what? Yo! Yep. You're teasing. Sorry, bad habit. And you're wrong. Oh! Not when I'm possessed. Uh, fair. Fair. <gasps> what? What? <laughs> Yo! And Rob is losing it. <laughs> Yo, let's go! That's adorable! It's adorable as shit! I love cute shit. I get hype on that all the time. If you've... Okay, there's... I'm gonna <laughs> tangent... I'm gonna go on a tangent. There's an anime... <laughs> there's an anime called My Love Story... Uh, the love is lowercase, but my and story are uppercase. Um, it's about, it, it's literally about this like big hulking, like bruiser of a high schooler guy. And he, he like 
saves this girl from like some creep on a train and he ends up falling in love with this girl, right? And the uh, first three uh, episodes in the first three episodes they play this will they won't they shit like oh, I don't think she likes me or blah 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 this or that. But then they get to the spoilers, they get together. And wow. the the rest of the 20 something episodes are literally just them building a healthy loving relationship it is the most adorable fucking show on the planet earth it everyone needs to watch that the dub <laughs> is great the sub is great all of it's great just watch that show it is so good and it has its feely moments too but it's never bad feels like there's never a moment of like <gasps> the drama of it all no it's literally <laughs> it is literally non-stop like good feels and bittersweet feels in all the right ways it is so good I get hype on that shit all the time. That explains a lot from last year. Sorry, now we didn't mean to keep it from you. Uh, we just didn't see much of you for the rest of that term. I kind of put the pieces together. You two were having such fun together without... Oh... Why no one likes like third wheeling. That? Yeah. Poor baby. Why'd you do that to them? I don't want Rook in my party anymore. Rook mean. Uh, I, uh, here's a, here's another thing about Safina though. Oh, what's up? So, now we now we have that moment that Safina and Rook were a bit more than friends at least at one point. Yeah, I could tell. And Rook still didn't know that she had a sister. Oh, that's a good point. Yo, it adds to my theory. I swear to God, Mary is just like some reincarnated form of Safina or some shit. Or like alternate dimension or something. I don't know. I'm going, I'm uh, going yeah. crazy on this fucking theory and that only adds to it. But for now, at the very least, what it does is, you know, it doesn't help Merit's sense of self yeah it certainly does not like she was already disappointed that her regular friends didn't know about her sister but for a significant other not to know is a whole other level yeah that's certainly not a good vibe right there where will you place the puppet Oh, didn't know that was coming. You won't play something <laughs> at all. That's what happened. Focus flame. Oh, that's... Don't I have a skill that's like that? Your regular ignite spell has that same circle. Yeah. The puppet can be any of the party members. Oh, it's random? Yep. They so got an I'm a clone this time. There we go. You love to see it. Okay, you moved and use your thing, and you get to do that again. Okay, great. You'll, it I must have see. really good speed compared to you. Yeah, okay. To be fair, my speed is not great for this party. Oh, well, mm, okay, well. Uh... Oh! Shit. The fact it also takes away your move <laughs> is kind of sucky. I don't like that part. 
Like if yeah, it just so stopped me. And, watch for him. <laughs> yeah, if it just stopped me in place, that'd be one thing. But the fact it also takes away your action is not great. But on the upside, when you lay a trap and the enemy stops there, it does the same to them. Let's try this move out. Hey, there we go. Yo, that's really good. And that was without a buff, yeah. too. Yeah, but I think it did have the uh, advantage of hitting a floating enemy. Oh, that's true. Shatter? Oh, boy. I want to see that one. What's that one? Damage targets and low... Yo, lower defense! Let's go! You're staying in my party for the rest of the fucking game. I don't care. <laughs> I love I love fucking debuffs like that. Let's go. Spinny, spinny. Oh hey. Perfect. I needed one of these. I need a cat. I need Someone a cat. to cuddle for the rest of the night. Oh jeez. Sorry, dude. It's gotta have fur and it's gotta meow and it has to treat me right. <laughs> uh, down one, but okay. You know what? That's kind of a. I love. Ooh, yo, that's like way good. Okay, hang on. I love yeah. how that's just I'm as default dress, and and anyone can wear it. <laughs> it's true. Uh, power down slightly, but defense and speed up. Yeah, I'll take that. Oh, what's this? No use, but worth its weight in gold. It sure is. But how heavy could it really have been? True. Uh... Oh, you doing all right over there? What's going on? Discord go crashies. Oh no. Oh, hang on. Hey, hey, oh. Hello? Yes. Okay, we're back. Don't know what the hell that was. I don't know either. Thanks, Discord. Love you. How are we doing on the stream? Okay, we're good on the stream. Just wanted to make sure of that. <clears throat> um hmm. it's like something in my ear and it's bother it's bothering me right now and I don't know what the fuck it is <laughs> it's just enough to bother me is it my voice no no because you weren't speaking <laughs> uh Ah! Uh, Alright. So, was it just the Discord that crashed, or was it also the game? Oh, no, 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 no. No, the game's on Xbox. It's fine. Um, I mean, even if the game did crash, you would just save. Yeah. Uh, by the way, here you go. Sorry about that. Discord! No! What are you doing? <laughs> Discord! No! <laughs> I want to hang out with my friend. Let me hang out. 
There. Ah! <laughs> Fuck you. You don't get to watch the game. You don't get to watch the game. Eat shit. Well, I could try watching it through the actual Twitch. You're going to be like 20 to seconds behind or something, though, just as a heads up. Hey, I don't know about 20 seconds. Eh, whatever. The the stream thing is usually not like great. Okay, what so I know you're on the equipment menu, you just put the dress on someone. Okay, that was only like ten seconds. Alright. You hit the green switch, you hit the pink switch, you hit the pink switch again. <laughs> Wee! <laughs> hmm. Back the fuck up. <laughs> trape. Trape. I said trape. That's it. That's the word I said. That's it. Don't come traipsing in here and mispronouncing words. Oh, well. Mm. Hell yeah. Why do you get like nine turns? Yeah, take more speed. I don't want speed. All right, you know what? Here, you're gonna back the fuck up. I cannot back it up. <laughs> Shit, dude, sorry. <laughs> Keep it moving. Get out of the way. Alright. You do, do, do. You do, do, do. Alright, there we go. Nice. 